my name is Jason Sheehan. I'm a professor of neurosurgery at the University of Virginia. I believe the Congress is a, a fantastic opportunity for members and, and guests to come and learn about cutting edge aspects of radio surgery, to have dialogue in a multidisciplinary fashion, and to really learn about new technologies, uh, new clinical data, and uh, to interact with members across the globe who are practicing in the field of, of stereotactic radio surgery and stereotactic body radiotherapy. I've found it exciting to be able to connect with friends who are across the globe who've come to this meeting in New York City. I've also found it exciting to learn about new technologies from our exhibit uh, vendors. And also, I've genuinely enjoyed the scientific sessions, particularly some of the sessions around guidelines, uh, around benign intracranial disease, and around vascular malformations. One of the values of being a member of the ISRS is that you have access to a lot of the information that, that is on the members portion of the ISRS website. That includes access to all the abstracts that are part of the meeting. You also have access to webinars and other uh, uh, content information that is really, I think, invaluable to those who are practicing in the field of stereotactic radio surgery and SBRT. I believe the guidelines really provide a framework, a foundation by which individuals can practice in a relatively consistent fashion based upon the evidence that is at, at currently available. The guidelines continue to be updated and they have reached some of the highest impact factor journals in the, our field, including Lancet, uh, in, uh, Journal of Neurosurgery, Neurosurgery, Journal of Neuro-Oncology. These guidelines uh, are really uh, high impact science and they provide a, a primer, if you will, uh, to individuals who are coming into the field. And for those who want an update, uh, uh, reading those guidelines can provide an update on all the information, some of which they may have seen, but some of which they may have missed.